What's up everybody, my name is Spencer and this is American Electrician and on today's video we're going to be talking about these pliers that I have never seen until recently but they are the Knipex Strix um, and so these are actually a very unique form of wire stripper. Um, it's more popular over in Europe but there are quite a few variations to even that style of stripper so uh, that's something we're going to dive into today if you're new to the channel welcome uh, on american electrician we do electrical how to's as well as gear reviews so if that is something that you are interested in go ahead and smash that subscribe button for me but for now let's get started okay so first thing i ran across these looking for a solution to a problem we're having not, not necessarily a problem but uh, just trying to make a process faster we are doing a bunch of solar connectors right now and I thought that this could eliminate the difference between um, the, I thought it could be useful basically uh, to help the, the process go faster and they didn't work the reason why they didn't work for the solar project is because of the insulation. Uh, it's, it's actually exposed wiring, and so it is not a thin jacket. It's very thick. Um, it's outside. I, I can't remember what kind of wire it is right now to save my life, but it didn't actually work for that application because of the thickness of the insulation. But we'll go over some of the features. Um, so first of all, it's the Strix. You'll see it in the title. But there's these two styles of handles. There's the comfort grip and there's also the insulated. Uh, and the insulated is actually not available in the US right now. I did have to order these, uh, I believe from Amazon UK, but these, um, I think they're on House of Tools or Amazon. So I'll leave a link in the description, but they work great. Uh, super great, super cool. Let's cover the features. Okay, so first thing is first, um, as you can see, there is a cutter right here in the middle, um, which is a shear. It's a great cutter, um, and it is followed up by this stripper here. Um, as you can see, uh, there is this little V-shape on each side, uh, which help you strip up to eight gauge wire. And if you turn to the side, um, there's this little nut and, and bolt here, um, which actually help you set the depth of it. So if you're doing something really repetitive, it's super great for that. Is this bottom one helps set the depth of how deep you wanna go. And then this top one that's inside the jaws actually helps to lock it in place so that it doesn't move on you. Um, and it, it just can you know, change obviously the, the diameter so you're not actually touching any of the copper or aluminum um, and then also there's these little steps right here and these just are to help indicate the length um, so obviously a very unique style of wire stripper so I've already set the depth on this um, and so I think that it's about right um, but basically you put it on here to your desired length twirl it around so Pretty simple, twirl it around, boom. And I found when I was doing it earlier, the easiest way was to clamp it down uh, and to make sure you could still move it in and out of the wire, but just barely. Uh, we'll back it all the way out until it's completely touching the copper. So it's on there. Um, and the screw, as you can see, is not touching anything. Um, basically, I'll just tighten it until it's making contact one more tighten I'll tighten up this uh, lock nut and then you're good to go boom it's really not hard to set up uh, it did my first time it took me a couple tries just to like get down a good process but it really doesn't take any time at all to uh, set up to the desired length. Not something I would want to change back and forth from all the time, but if I am doing a lot of 12 or 14 gauge, um, especially solid, it is a very good option. 
Uh, so just a couple of useful things that I think this would be great for um, are when you have very short wires inside of a box, um, repetitive work, anything you would like to strip uh, going away instead of using the side of your pliers. It really is a pretty cool tool. Knipex usually does bring us some pretty innovative things. So if this is something you guys are interested in, I do suggest checking it out. I believe uh, each set was about 50 50, uh, 50 or $55, but that is it for today. I appreciate it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys on the next one.